Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. At my previous video, I showed how a circular movement is done in Microsoft PowerPoint. If you have not watched it yet, you can reach it at the top right of the screen. Today, we will use the same information to make the Milky Way animation. Let's start with adding some circles. The first circle is for the sun. I will leave the dimensions as it is and I will just change the colors, no outline and I think this color is ok for the sun. So we will give it some three dimensional effects. So I will open the menu, ok, bevel, top bevel is circular and bottom is again circular. The values are 35 and I think it's better now. Let's continue with some more effects. Maybe it's better now. And it's like sun. I want to rotate it also. Maybe like this. And I have to move it to center. What do you think about it? I think it's like the sun. Sun is at the center of our presentation. And then we will continue with the planets. For the first planet, I will add again a circle, but for the others, I will copy the first planet. Let's write 1.3 and no outline. Let's change also the color. Uh, this circle will be Mercury. So let's select a color related with Mercury. I think it's good. We will do the same thing for all plants, uh, but the value will be 20 right now. Okay. Let's check the material. Maybe it's better. And I'm not sure about the lightning. Let's go back. It seems good. Uh, for the angle, zero is okay. I'll, I will not change the angle. Uh, let's give it. A rotation and then move it to the center distance 24 is okay for the center I think it's good now and then I will add one more circle for its orbit uh, let's prepare it for the orbit. In this time we will have outline. I prefer this blue and the shape doesn't have any color inside. So it's dimensions should be like this but for better uh, dimensions let's try it here. What do you think? I think it's okay. Let's move it to the center and move it to the front. It seems transparent. I think I select something incorrect here. You know, th this is a transparent color. So I will check some more options. Maybe it's better to leave it as default. 
Firstly, I will add the root for this planet and then copy it. Otherwise, we will have to put uh, the root to each planet separately. So I prefer to edit right now. As you can see, we have to modify it. I will change it to the opposite direction. I think it's okay. And then I will change the options from here. Start with previous and repeat it until next click. As you remember from the first video, these options should not be selected. So we will have a good uh, rotation here. Let's check it. It seems okay. Let's copy it for the next planet. Firstly, let's copy the or orbits and then we will know. Where's our plant? And then it will be easier for us to replace all the plants. I think it's okay for the second plant. Let's give it 9 and 15. I think it's at the center. Okay. Let's duplicate it for Earth. Yes, now the orbits of all the plants are ready. So it will be easy for us to put uh, the animation. So let's duplicate Mercury to create Venus. Now I know its exact position. And I know its root. If I click this zero, it will automatically select the root. And its root is, its root is here. Let's try again. Venus is okay. Copy it for Earth. Let's duplicate Pluto. I don't know it's still a planet or not. Yes, now all planets and their orbits are here. So let's try how it looks like. And I think it's okay for us. We will because we will make some more adjustment so it will seem better. But right now it's okay. Let's start with changing the colors. For Mercury, uh, I will use this color. As you know, Saturn has a special color. I couldn't uh, find the similar one at this list, so I uh, I select this uh, color from a picture. So it's exactly the color of Saturn.
as you know all the planets have different size if you want you can change the size of each planet accordingly so you will use this option and you have to mod modify also the bevels depending on your, your dimension but I will leave each plant at the same size as I mentioned all plants has different velocity so we have to change their velocity right now I have prepared an exile file here you can see all the plants and their exact uh, years so I normalized the values here uh, and I will introduce these values to here let's start with Pluto uh, we will go animation option okay uh, but it's better to click zero instead of the object so if I click zero it will change the uh, orientation and the animation here so we will uh, work better I will change its speed with this menu okay duration so I will write here 496 let's continue with Neptune Before uh, moving my animation, I want to select all plants and sun and go to shape format and I want to move all it forward. And then I want to move my um, the frame of my board again to the front let's try one more time yes the planets are moving like this it's very nice As you know, Saturn is a bit different than the others. So let's try how we can do it. Go to Saturn and format shape. Uh, I will add a contour there. And we can select a gray. If you like the animation, please like the video on YouTube and share with your fans. And do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.